Hello, Kyle, Tim, and Brittany. Mark Alderman from Alderman Chevrolet Buick GMC, Vermont's favorite car dealership. We're best known for awesome deals and fabulous service. Thank you all for inquiring about the 2021 GMC Yukon XL AT4. Now the AT4 comes with all sorts of additional features. Underneath the hoods, a 5.3 liter V8 engine puts out 355 horsepower, 383 foot-pounds of torque. Importantly, it's married to a 10-speed automatic transmission, which is the latest and greatest transmission from General Motors. Now you also get features such as those uh, two-tone 20-inch aluminum wheels that are unique to the AT4 with all-terrain tires. Working our way around the front, we've got the signature C-shaped LED daytime running lights that surround that tri-stack of LED reflector headlamps and lower LED fog lights. You've got the red uh, trailer or towing hooks there below uh, with uh, a chrome or stainless steel um, metal skid uh, plate there that protects the undercarriage. You've got the iconic GMC front and grill that's uh, kind of blacked out with a little bit of chrome. Less chrome on the AT4 than some of the other models such as the SLT and the Denali. Makes for a very popular appearance. Working our way down the side, we've got um, lights and turn signals built into the uh, rear view mirrors. You've got nice, subtle, fixed running board um, that's installed on this. And then also you've got a passive uh, door lock system. So as long as you've got the key fob in your pocket here, you can lock and unlock the doors just with the push of a button. You also have capless gas filler, uh, which doesn't sound like a big deal, but it is nice uh, not having to mess with a gas cap. Taking a look on the inside, what's unique about this vehicle is that it's got the middle row bench seat. So you have three passenger seating in the middle row. Um, you can either flip this down here with a pull of this handle and that flips down and forward. Uh, gives you access to the three passenger uh, third row seat there and that's a 60-40 split folding rear seat. Let's see how sharp looking the interior is. And then um, this seat, depending on your combination of people and cargo, uh, you can move the seat, uh, the middle row seat forward or backwards. And so what you do here is you lift this up, pardon me, pardon my camera work, but lift this up and you can slide that back. We also have a fold down armrest here with some cup holders and a little storage in there. Hopping inside, got a very athletic interior with premium finish and craftsmanship that's obvious throughout. A lot of room in the middle row here. Um, you've got there's some HVAC controls. Um, that you can set it to a temperature or do manual uh, settings. You've got vents underneath the seats. Um, you've got a 120 volt outlet here, uh, USB, or what is that? Let's see. Those are, those are USB ports there, uh, A ports. And then uh, you've got heated seats. And check out the front portion of the interior is really beautiful well appointed um, premium materials used throughout uh, nice combination of metallic accents French stitching soft touch materials throughout the entire vehicle uh, nice clean contemporary center stack huge 10 inch uh, uh, GMC Intel link display which I'll give you a closer look on Here. There's an embossed finish there, and we'll go ahead and take a quick look into the third row here. Give you an idea of what this looks like back here. A little bit different view of the interior. You can see the arm, um, the headrest fold down in the back, gives enhanced visibility if there aren't people in the vehicle. You also have roof vents uh, for comfort throughout the rear, rearward portion of the 
interior cabin. Inside, you see the soft touch and various materials throughout. Really well appointed again. There's the driver door controls, upgraded Bose sound system. You've got an embossed aluminum AT4 there on the sill plate. I love these. Uh, this is this color is called Kalahari. How much do you think somebody got paid to name that color Kalahari? I'll bet quite a bit but makes for a really sharp looking, again, kind of an athletic, very premium feel on the interior. Inside, we've got wireless Apple CarPlay, uh, wireless charging for your phone here. There's another storage solution there for your phone. Nice deep center console. There's my face mask. That portion removes there. You can see the size of that touchscreen display. Go ahead and turn the fan down here. And then this is the full instrument package, and it's all digital. So all the all the gauges are digital, and uh, there's quite a few different solutions for customizing that. Now this has electronic shifting, so there's there's no shifter to deal with, just these buttons. It's a really nice touch. It takes a little bit getting used to, but it's super nice. So when we put it in reverse, there you've got a uh, huge uh, high definition rear camera. It's got guide bars on there that turn when you turn the steering wheel. And then you can also shift the view uh, in order to line up a trailer hitch as well. So we'll see that there's two different cameras there on the back. Let me take a look at that. And then this is a nice thick leather wrap steering wheel. You've got that Kalahari uh, French stitching all around on that steering wheel there with some nice brushed aluminum accents throughout and other metallic accents. Everything's soft touch and premium everywhere you touch and feel. here uh, we can push this button it's power up and power down on the rear lift gate tons of room in the back as you can see and there's some added storage here underneath it's all nice and finished off and then if we choose to we can fold our seats um, uh, either we can control the rear seats here or the middle seats. So we can fold down this left seat and that's power up and power down. So I can push the button and fold that back up. Now the middle row is just power down. you could fit a lot of stuff in the back there so but you have a lot of flexible options with the dual 60 40 split folding seats and then again with the key fob we can lower that lift gate there gives you another view here So Kyle, Tim, and Brittany, I hope, you, I hope I got your names right. That is the 2021 GMC Yukon XL AT4. If you'd like to learn more, just click the learn more button below. Or if you're on YouTube, you can. Uh, there's a link in the comment section. Or come see it for yourself at Alderman Chevrolet Buick GMC, 
Route 7 South in Rutland.